right. We've tarried here long enough. But before anything, I think we've earned the right to take a little souvenir. This should do nicely. <laughs> Very nice. Anyway, let's just have these. Let's double check. Is anything else of value? Huh. I don't think Toth Deer will be bothering with some little trinkets. He's much too absorbed by his new toy. I'll be off, old man. Enjoy playing with your little ball. <laughs> there shouldn't be any more dangers here. What is that? Is that wall? Singing. What? What was that all about? Some sort of Nord magic. It's gone now. Nice. We should check at the library if there's something, anything about singing walls. Apprentices must have left ages ago. Wonderful show of support. some new perks. And we definitely want Nemesis. Activate any hostile creature or humanoid in combat to summon an illusion of the target with 1% extra attack damage per illusion level. Wonderful. That will be very useful. As will this. Kindred Mage. V. 
fickle fate. We have to keep ourselves safe. Who are you? You. Who are you? Fugitive. Take this and hold on to it. I'll be back for it later. I'll pay you good. Slow Don't down. Listen. Explain yourself. No time to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I mean it. Striking. Will pale shadow work now? Apparently it worked. It's just that his shadow is as cowardly as him. See someone run past just now. I presume that these gauntlets of the accursed belong to you. Yes. How did you get this? Uh, oh, never mind. Here. It's not much, but it's something. I'm going to track down that thief and murder him. You. You nods are not very smart, are you? Oh well. Huh. Backpack. Might as well take this. Nah, it's not worth it. This might actually be a bit better than our current backpack make ourselves look a bit more what happened are you all right them anyway. Well, let's put on the face cover. And these gauntlets. Y 
you serve me now. Whatever you are. Come on. Right, hopefully our new friend will keep us safe from these wolves. Very nice. <laughs> All right. Now this is a wonderful little discovery. We don't need our ghost be around us right now. Let's let's just put him away when we don't need him. Awesome. If we disenchant the gloves, we can perhaps put it on some lighter garment. Hopefully it will transfer our friend to that article. No problem. Fortunately, we're not that good at enchanting just yet, but having this enchantment will be very useful. And we are back at the college. Should be safe from here. Unless we drop off the bridge. Not going to happen. Whoa. It's Mirabelle. Just collect. Need to talk to the Archmage. Alright, it's the first time that we've been here. How we expected. Very nice. Oh. Hello? You are relatively new here, are you not? I have noticed you, but we have not spoken. No, we haven't. Then allow me to introduce myself. I am Savos Arin, Archmage of the College of Winterhold. I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here. But I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the college. Are we clear? Crystal. That aside, I need to speak to you about Sarthal. Ah, please don't tell me that another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. I have enough to deal with right now. No. Something a bit more interesting. We found some sort of orb. Toftia wanted you to see it. I see. I trust that Toftia will provide a more specific explanation. Probably. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. <sighs> Toftia normally looks after your little group, yes? Since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for myself, I think perhaps you should begin researching the subject. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, perhaps this will be helpful. Huh. Thank you, I guess. I will take my leave then. Mm-hmm.
Huh. So the Archmage is a Dunmer. Very intriguing. See Lady Mirabel outside. There you are. I've been trying to find you. Huh. I just wanted to let you know that Ancano's been asking about you. I think he's looking for you. And why would Ancano be looking for me? I'm not sure. Just well mind what you tell him, alright? Is there a problem? No no. Well, I don't think so. Between the two of us, there are rumors about him. That this advisor position he has is a sham, an excuse. That what he's really doing is spying for the Thalmor, trying to feed them information. Whether it's true, I can't say. But it never hurts to be a little suspicious, does it? Thanks for the warning. You're welcome. It's been a pleasure. Well, you're both Altma. You think you know. You sound just like Toph, dear. Alright. Where is Lady Mirabel? She could probably be inside the students hall all right well, this is our room which you actually haven't spent too much time in huh So bad at navigating this place. Hello. There you are. What were you doing? Hiding? Hello? I understand you're the one that found this orb in Sarthal. Yes. I hope we haven't inconvenienced you. <laughs> anyway, the Archmage asked me to see you about class. Yes, from what I've heard, I expect Tofdil will be occupied for some time. Hmm, that is a problem, isn't it? I suppose someone else will need to look after the apprentices for now. Are you suggesting that we are now hall monitor? Hmm. And what should I do if there's no class? Well, perhaps it's time for some independent study. Check with Urag Groshav in the <coughs> Arcanium. See if he's aware of any references to this thing that you and Tolftir found. I'd like to know as much as we can about it. Huh. All right. It's actually interesting. And before anything else... I'm going to need some more food. But before anything else, let's have ourselves a short nap. Oh. 
Excuse me. This is my room, cat. You're lucky that I find you rather cute. Can you... Can you possibly help Jazargo? Oh, so you need our help. Fine. What did you need help with? Jazargo has seen that Torfdir likes you. He does? You must be very skilled with magic, yes? Jazargo is working hard, but cannot do it alone. Can you help with this? And exactly what kind of help do you need? Jezargo has worked hard on learning new spells, trying new things. This will make Jezargo stand out as a mage. But Jezargo works so hard, there is no time to test these new spells. If you help with the testing, this will make learning easier. Jezargo will give you scrolls. You will use them and report the results. This is a good plan, no? You tell Jezargo when you are ready. All right, Silk will help. I'll help you. Just give me the scrolls. Ha, you can resist, can you? Ha! Let's see. This one, I think. Jezargo has designed it to be an excellent flame cloak. With a twist. It is especially potent against the undead, and should burn them to a crisp in no time. Jezargo gives you plenty of these scrolls, so you try them and return when you can say whether they work. All right. This would have been a very big help if you had given them to us a couple of hours ago. All right. Jezargo awaits word of how well his scrolls work. Whatever. When I come back, you'd better not be here. And you'd better not be leaving hairballs all over the place. Flame Cloak. For 30 seconds, opponents in melee range take 10 points per second. Huh? Interesting. Let's put that on my favorite. I need your help, Asim. What? We shouldn't have been disturbing Sarthal, no matter what you found down there. New here, too, eh? I'd hoped I wouldn't be the only Nord. But I should have known better. And why aren't there many Nords at the college? This is your country, after all, Skyrim. Magic is shunned by most. If it can't be swung over your head and used to crack skulls, most Nords want nothing to do with it. <laughs> Magic is seen as something for elves and weaker races. No offense, of course. None taken. Anyway, you said something about needing our help. Something wrong? Yes, but it needs to be kept quiet. I may have entered into an agreement with Enther. He had something I needed, so I traded him something of mine. It was a mistake, and now I want back what I gave him. It's an amulet that belonged to my family, and I never should have given it to Enther. But he won't deal with me. Talk to him. See what it'll take to get my amulet back. Fine. All right, whatever. We'll see what we can do. Until next time. You're lucky. We are feeling rather industrious. Ah. Oh. library is managed by an orc. How quaint. Hello? You are now in the Arcanium, uh, of which I am in charge. Yes, It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. I... Disrupt my Arcanium, uh, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Now, do you require assistance? I need to learn about something we found in Southall? I know what you want. 
Word travels fast around here. Discovered some big mystery, huh? Well, you don't even need to ask. No, I don't have anything for you. Not what? anymore, anyway. This entire library and you don't have anything that can help. I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. Some kind of peace offering. I oh. think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. Who is this Orthorn? He was an apprentice here at the college. Not <sighs> very skilled, but got involved with a group of mages who took a liking to him. When they left, he took off after them. Stole supplies and books from the college. I suppose as a way to ingratiate himself. <sighs> Doesn't anybody care that this Orthorn stole things from the college? Not enough to bother with. Archmage Aaron's approach to these things is just to let them sort themselves out. In other words, he's Although lazy. now it looks like you'll be doing the sorting. Good luck with that. Ha 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 ha. And why are these mages? Why were they driven away to Felglow Keep? Let's just call it a difference of opinion with the college. They were interested in research that goes outside the bounds of what the college allows, so they were persuaded to leave. Interesting. All right. Uh... Might as well ask, are there any special books you're looking for? As a matter of fact, there are. Have you ever heard of Shalador? Immensely powerful huh. mage, back in the first era. Had an understanding of magic few have ever matched. He holed himself up in Labyrinthian and devoted all his time to research and study, but more than you would imagine possible. Since then, his writings have been scattered all over Skyrim, but are little use to anyone who can't translate them. I'm one of the few who can. Well, good for I've you. I've heard whispers of more of his work having turned up. If you can track it down, it may prove useful to all of us. All right, I'll keep my eye out. Well, I'll be off to Felglow Keep then. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Oh. You there. I have questions for you. You were in Sarthorn, yes? It has come to my attention that something was found there. Maybe. I know full well that you have. Please <laughs> do not insult my intelligence. Tolfdir is still there now, is he? I shall expect a full report when he returns. And why does this matter to you? Something was discovered in Sarthol that was significant enough that Torfdir sent a new member of the college alone to deliver word. That sounds precisely like the sort of thing that should matter to everyone, especially me. Thank you for your help. You may go now. We may go now. Arrogant bastard. It'll be worth it to do this mission just to get out of here and far away from him. All right. We're going to need some food and some supplies. We haven't been to the town proper itself. We should check it out. There should be a, a general goods store at least. Otherwise this town would be dead. Way out here in this God's forsaken armpit of Skyrim. Is this it? Burner's Oddments. Hello? 
I'll sell just about anything if it's worth my time. Keep that in mind, will you? Huh. Do you get much business way up here? Very funny. I'm sure you've noticed that Winterhold isn't joke. exactly overflowing with people. So I'll sell whatever I can. If it's worth putting a price on, you can bet I'll do it. I've been burned a few times, made a few bad deals, but mostly I come out on top. Huh. You said something about a bad deal. Yeah, it was stupid of me. I shouldn't have believed the story and just refused the trade. But I didn't, and now I'm stuck with this worthless junk. And what was the story? Some line about this claw thing and Ingol Barrow. He said it was worth more than its weight in gold if I took it back then. Something about placing it back in Ingol's chamber, I don't know. What was I thinking? Even if it were true, I'm not setting foot in some ancient tool filled with who knows what. Huh. I could look into this for you. I don't even care anymore. You want to check it out? Fine. I'll sell you the thing for 50 gold and then it's your problem. Hmm. Alright, I'll take that claw for 50 gold. Fine, here you go. You get killed on account of this thing? It's not my fault. Got it? Hmm. But I suppose if it does actually turn out to be worth something, let me know, will you? I make no promises. Let me see your other wares, please. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Is there anything we can sell you? Take these. Take this. We can disenchant this. Take this and this. And two of those. I guess we can sell this. Hmm. Yeah, might as well keep it. Why aren't we wearing our necklace? Saying that. Sell these. Alright. We don't need these poisons. Huh. Coral Dragon Claw. Huh. Fifty gold. Whatever. You have any food? You don't. Really. Useful potions. This should be useful. Taking that. Uh, let's sell these garnets. Alright. Thank you. Alright then. Huh? That was fast. Suddenly dark. Uh, let's. Probably it's best to have dinner here at the inn. We can buy some food. I'm sorry, could you describe the smell? Lots of people. Which means This is why people have a problem with your college, Nelikar. Welcome. Huh. Let me know if you want anything. Think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. All right. If there's anything you need, just let me know. Food, please. Take a look. All right. I'll take your water skin. Uh, did 
we buy it from him? Yes. Alright, food. We'll take the salmon steak. And the lavender dumpling. Mmm. Juniper berry cristata. Taking those. Do you have any of those ubiquitous sweet rolls? No. Hmm. Oh well. I'll take the bread. Take the apple pie and the apple dumpling. And an ale. I think that's fine. Alright. That should do. I'd like to rent a room as well. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. All right. And please refill my water skins. Of course. All right. Anything uh, work related? I'm an adventurer of sorts. Are there any leads for work? Here. Take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Hmm. Anything else? Any juicy rumors? Helgen? What? Speak up. Helgen. A dragon. I wanted to... Right this way. I wanted to hear about rumors, not fairy tales. Huh. Quaint. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Thank you. Just privacy, please. Which is asking too much, given that your room has no door. Fine. Walking the world. Perhaps another time. Let's have a little dinner. Is everything well, Nella? <sighs> oh yes, quite. Referring to your other customers? No, everything is quite all right. Need I expect something? a bit of animosity now and then. Hello, excuse me. I see. Well, let me know if things get out of hand. I'd like a refill of water, please. Of course. All right. Thank you. See ya. Got something to say? Not to you, wherever you are. All right. The carriage should be over there. So, we are headed for the central area of Skyrim. White Run, I believe. The trade capital of this province. Should be very interesting. We've never been there. Should be a nice change of weather. Hello. Need a ride? I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? White Run. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Gratefully. Ever been to White Run before? The Jarl's Palace is something to see. Dragon search, they call it. Big old dragon skull hanging on the wall. 